Hello, everybody. Welcome back to our show, Mapantula Aravi, Sibuilam Tagati. And yes, this is the end of your tour, Springbok edition. I'm going to move forward to Coach Raga Hamban. Uh, good on yourself, Sandawan. <laughs> I knew okay. that would get you excited. This is a rugby show, everybody. I'm good, I'm good. It's been a great, great autumn series this past weekend. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Yeah, thoroughly enjoyed it. All good. Jess, I'm glad that you guys are all in great spirits. 2-0. Um, actually, it's actually 3-0. Because the SA is key almost. Yeah. So, should you be worried? How, you, how do you guys feel about that? Hey, New Zealand is Tete Lela. Uh, Southern Hemisphere. Do it. New Zealand is Tete Lela. Uh, so how do you guys feel about that? No, I means it. Uh, running a show now. It's 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 one of those things. It's it's something that we spoke about last week, and then and I think everything or the plan is coming together. With the what do you use the end of year to for? Yes, would love to win. Uh, don't get me wrong, but yeah, see how how good was the game last week? How how good were the performances? If 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 now the players know who's who in the zoo kind of thing, you know. So yeah. Yeah, look, Z, 0-3, if you count the SAA results. But but I think Ruggs makes a good point because we've got to look at, at, at the purpose of the tour. And I think, yes, results matter. But this is bigger than just the wins and losses column. I think we're building towards something and, and we've got to take that into account. Uh, Ruggs makes a good point in terms of, of how, how the team played. Mm. Um, we saw a different... Something a different. different. different yeah. Leon's plan B. <laughs> Yeah, I think I think we'd call it plan A eh? uh. because the selections were made around their game plan. We all had issues with Mapimpi being dropped uh, or mm -hmm. moved to the bench, dropped is the wrong word. But it, it was very clear when the game started evolving that we picked three fullbacks uh, and we didn't want to kick the ball back. We wanted to run, so three dynamic runners. Mapimpi is a great finisher, but I don't think he's an open play kind of kind of winger. And, and, that, and that showed up in the way we played because we knew France would kick. That was their plan. And instead of kicking the ball back and playing, gaining grounds, we said, we'll let them kick and we'll run it at them. So, so Jacques showed us a plan that we weren't ready for. And I, and I found that entertaining. Jacques, okay, sorry. Like, I'm but you but Zed, 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 let me, let me, let me, oh, one question. Do you think the red card forced us into that plan? No. So I've got a question, right? I don't think so. I've, I've got a question. I, think, I, think, I think that was always the plan. Uh, the red card just made it easier because it looked like we were... Because we weren't chasing the game at that point. The red card happened that early that the game had just started and it was still a kicking competition between the kickers. And it just, we were always going to play... In my opinion, we were always going to play that way. I don't think the red card had a factor. I'd like to ask you guys something. Uh -huh. So um, last year, I don't know, at the same time, uh, we were deemed as boring. Like we played against the British and Irish and then it was... We were like the box of boring, uh, this. But everybody kept on saying, "But I can't wait for them to play the same game against France." So then, Plan B: Were we scared to play our game plan, like our normal game against France, or it was just a stroke of genius from U coach saying, "But they're expecting us to do this, so let's." Hit them with the... Uh, <laughs> over to you, coach. No, 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 no man. <laughs> all, all, all I'm saying is that, you know, I, I got the feeling that red card, agents back against the wall, let's go, boys. Yeah. Uh, it's, 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 it's up to us. I, I even said it. I said less than 50. But now guys were like, listen, okay, cool. Uh, it's up to me now. Do you know what I'm saying? Everyone now, Faf shows, let see, his money's worth. Sia, Eben, and we're going to speak about it later with you. Check, check out that group, gents. Be it the guys that start, be it the guys that come off the bench. Yes, see. Those guys are flipping. They're good in each position. They, they're the maniers. From, from, from where I sit, I, I honestly think the answer, answer Zola's question is the, it's the latter. He, he said everyone expects us to do this. So how about we do something different? Because, and, and that's why I'm going to the red card thing to say, the, the similar set plays that were ran, that were ran before the red card and after the red card. Like the, the line out where the winger picks the ball at the back of the mall and runs it in. Yeah, they, 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 they did that the whole game. Yeah. It had nothing to do with, we have seven forwards or eight forwards. It was a matter of, this is the plan that we're going to use to suck in the French defense, and they kept doing it. France yeah. don't make that many mistakes, so we had a different game plan. 
we try to play position rugby instead of kicking and playing off their mistakes, which is an interesting way to, to look at it. So, Rugs, I'm also going to put you again on the spot. Is it? <clears throat> <laughs> but, so, the game, we can, now, after that game, obviously now we can, we can, we can draw. Don't you think it's at least 10 games too late for us to show that hand? Or, I've, I, like, there were times where I felt like in the rugby championship we could have played that expensive game and we could have gotten away with it. And then now, we, like, we'll know that um, these kind of players can strive under these kind of conditions and we can do this kind of thing. You don't think it's that, or you think it's a, a game no, I mean, stroke of genius <laughs> from the main man. And, 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 and I understand what, what, what Lunga is saying in terms of good team. Maybe a game plan, but I'd, I'd love to just maybe even look at the individuals now. Uh, you, <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> and when I say individuals, it is we spoke about character not being, 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 being measured and stuff. But for the first time, guys were, you know, backs against the wall. Then they actually came out to play. They, they, they actually, you yeah, see that Arons, uh, he's playing against a flanker at wing. And then, then you, you have to admit, uh, what's his name? Siko. He, 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 he's an athletic. No, but he's, a, he's athletic. He's, I, I was actually impressed with these things because he's athletic. He's everything. You know, one time he's in the scrum, one time he's standing at wing and stuff like that. But Arons didn't stand back. And then if, if ever, I thought that game more than, yeah, the beautiful game in terms of uh, uh, the game plan and stuff like that. But now you actually found out, good to, okay, cool. Who's the guys that you can take into, into, into the trenches? Who's the guys that you can take into those passages, those dark... It's not even passages, it's passage. <laughs> guys, uh, we won't be South Africans if we don't complain about the ref. I think the, uh, the ref had a great first 70... Oh. Yeah, and you mentioned um, during the week that uh, at that level, you can't be cleaning like that. Yes, you got to push. And, it, yeah, you know, uh, that's a proper red card. Uh, to point also, it's a proper... But then, uh, <laughs> how do you guys feel about him in the last time? What went wrong? Like, he had a great game. And then 10 minutes before we um, before uh, the final was, like, I, I don't know. He, he, started, like, he started just losing his mind there. But Nakona, yes, he has that atmosphere. How's, yeah. how's, the, how's the French, the singing? Jiffy was also looking for you on TV. I couldn't find you, Jiffy. <laughs> but I, I thought, I thought, yeah, and, and, and he's a human being. Uh, it, and we can say human being, he's experienced. Um, he's supposed to be doing his job. But as well, did you see how the directors don't play? Yeah. Uh, the replays, but if, if it's beneficial to the French, all of a sudden yeah. it, it's played. The, the sound, uh, the, the sound goes off. <laughs> all of a sudden, he can't hear. He can't hear. So, so <clears throat> it's one of those things that, and I think as a team, South Africa will will, will take away good tea. Listen, you get that experience now. When you come back in a year's time, you you you're not phased by anything. You've seen this picture before. You've seen this movie before, and then. Yes. Yeah, it builds character. Yeah, it builds character. But I just think, I, I also find it rather convenient. That whole lack of communication with the TMO. Because... The two are part. The two are the two are part. Even apparently, the Heineken Cup, top 40, the two are part. Are we yeah. going to let them get away with this during the World Cup? Because then they might as well just be in the final now. Because, the, like, like, like Ruggs is saying, yes, Wayne Barnes is human. But we're also going to look at the fact that that's why you have the TMO. To, to remove those kind of errors. That's why rugby has evolved as a sport to go, to take out the, the glaring human yeah. mistakes, let's look at the small things. And he asked about how it works with uh, broadcasting and everything. Mm -hmm. It's my game. I stop it. Yeah, I stop and say, oh, it's I'll, walk up, like, yeah, I'll walk yeah. up and say, is yeah. that a try or not? Why, like, you say, why do you make a, a big decision like that? Changes the game like this. That, that won the game? Yeah. Yeah, even John Ferry's yellow card now, Connor. It's, 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 it's. Yes, yes. They, 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 how many penalties? Yeah. They, they, they don't even, they just get a warning. But yeah, but the light, he also pulls out from that, from that, uh, from that rack. Like if you have one, he pulls out and then he goes back in. So really, like, what's it, Dion sees him and then he goes for it and then it's a yellow card. Okay, James, um, it's all positive. Like from, uh, from, um, all, like if they begin, James, um, before he won the World Cup 2007. Jake lost, I think, his first two games. He got called down to Cape Town. 
<laughs> by accepting that. La Machita, Tina, now we all happy for them. But then we are two nil down. We all like we talk about the positives. And say, Don't you think Urasi and his antics on Twitter and all these videos uh, play a big role? Takes away pressure away from maybe because all we sit now and talk about is like we're sitting and talking about, geez, we, we our kicking was great. Uh, like we just talking about positive, positive, but back in the run, Sikiwe, two nil. Don't you so do you think like yes, apparently it leaves a bad a bad taste. I think again, Urasi is running what, what? stroke of genius. Well, like I'll take all the pressure. All the I need pressure. a friend like him, actually. Like, well, uh, so you do what you have to do. I'll take care of the pressure. Ma, he's a, he's a, he's a, I don't, don't want to say like proper South African, like in terms of, you know, as as a, as, as a coach, he, he, he takes he takes he takes. So much criticism, is, is not even coach, director of rugby. He takes everything, all the attention away from the team. Then everything is focused on him. Then C and the boys can just focus on the rugby. Because everyone else, world rugby is trying to fight him and concentrating on him. At the end of the day, gents, uh, yes, I, I, and I know I've been singing this, this thing. You, you'd say I'm staying in Cape Town with Leon. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I generally, I generally have a good feeling about the where Springbok Rugby is going. Uh, even with the SAA loss, a couple of guys, yes, professionals getting together uh, for a couple of days and still playing. But yes, he, guys will learn from this, man. Yeah, well, look, SAA is playing again tonight. You know, mm. so so let's oh, see Bristol Bears because because that's the it's it's roughly the same team. Um, there haven't been too many changes. I don't know. We've got Sasha, Sasha Fierce <laughs> uh, playing, <laughs> playing at ten. <laughs> and, uh, even, and Grant, even Grant, even Grant, even yeah. Grant at nine. Man, he, he's Adelity, special. Uh, Gianni Lamba at fifteen. Uh, Gianni, Gianni for me is is a very underrated rugby player. I think he's I think he's a special talent. Well, if you watch if you watch our first few shows, coach. Been going on when he went oh, to Japan. Oh, like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. okay, no, okay. no, but I okay, but uh, let me say one bad thing to a Lions player. Uncle Shippas, man. You know, Uncle Van Veik, uh, he, he's a strong ball carrier, but he's going to be one one of those guys that uh, one show, one, one trick, trick pony. pony. Yeah, one trick, pony, one yeah. trick pony. So, but he's a nice, strong but young lad. Kid, I'm man, excited. He's 20? Like yeah, 21? he's, he's so very I think, I think I think those are things you can correct. I mean, the the, yeah. what, what, the the best number thirteen in the world now is currently injured. He wasn't a finished product at twenty one. Right? Uh, exactly. Oh, thank so you. I think these are things that that Henko will five six oh eight. More player of the year. Not Represent. The uh, but he's, he's not the finished product yet, and it's and it's good that he gets the exposure now. Yeah, he gets the exposure now, and we can critique those things and, and fix those. And that's where we come back to the end of year tour. Uh, if if you're using the end of year tour to blood guys. Learn the culture, see the overseas, uh, overseas trip, and then yeah, it's a yeah, we've got, we've got a nice to debate with number nines now, right? Like oh, because Corvus, look at it, Corvus hey. can play, Corvus can play. Five, 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 back the clock for me. Yeah, five can kick now. Yeah, what's what's great? What's great? What's great is that uh, <clears throat> um, Fav said something like I think a week ago. He says that like, um, uh, the the jersey means a lot to me after. Yeah, like after uh, dro dropping to second base, like this jersey means a lot. I now know, like, yo, sorry, English. -ish. Yeah. No. I now know how it feels, like, I, to be a bark again. Yeah. yeah, to be a bark. Which, which is, like, because the bark jersey is not cheap anymore. Yeah. Like, you, know, you have to work for it. You have to work for it. And, and now he has to bring in another dimension. And now he has to, did you see that kick? Hey, that touchline conversion. Whoa, 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 whoa. 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 That was, that was, that was okay, just, okay, just to show so we all agree that we do have a plan B. Now, I wouldn't call it a plan B. I'd just say we've got We're not options. one trick ponies anymore. We've got options. We've got we've options. Got options. There's, there's, there's game plans, plural. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so the game plans, not just kicking. So the world should be scared of us now. Italy. James, what's happening with the, with the, with the starting line? With the uh, donkey at 12, donkey at like, I love them. At the inside and outside. So I what's going to happen? We, I, Other, I, I, like I, had this, I, had, I had this debate. I had this debate. Like, well, there's this conversation about... Sorry for calling them donkeys. This debate about... Andre, Andre's played well enough for me to, to merit the selection in the start. It's been a couple right? of years, yeah. But do we have another option mm. at 13? That's the thing for me. 
Like, do we have another option at 13 that that literally, because I'm just injured, right? You can't mm-hmm. cry for spilled milk. You hopefully, he'll be ready for next year. Mm-hmm. But you have to play Damien there because looking at the touring squad, we don't have another option there. Because it's Chelsea, who hasn't exactly played badly, but he hasn't mm-hmm. really put his hand up to say, in Am's absence, this is my jersey. Mm. So I don't know if the Jesse part is injury enforced. No, I haven't seen the press conference. But I think it's, it's an experiment worth trying, right? Because, I mean, it's Italy. Even with as, 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 as Damien, uh, Damien Allen, uh, Delenda, yeah. in terms of taking think. us. Yeah, I mean, and it, he, oh, he's going to, he's going to, he, he's, he's, He's a strong kid. He runs nice, hard lines and stuff like that. So, so I think it's an experiment. And what we spoke about, Wootsie, check at the depth at nine, at, 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 at hooker, even at the props. Now, let's see what the depth is at, at the centers. Because you got Jesse to cover Lucanio arm. Now, you don't have anyone to cover the 12. So, and you still got Willem said they can play 12. Can so, play 12. so when Pollard comes back, and I can do, also play 12. Sasha's gonna start at Ted at SAA. It's gonna be brilliant, man. So let's see, let's see what we have. So if this experiment works and we got Libok on the bench, how about we start um, Libok at 10, play uh, Damon at 12, and have Dylan at 13? Yes, he coach. Well done. Where's but like, it's, it's, no, but like, that's, a, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. But like, Zola, you, not, not in a funny way. Then, then these are the kind of combinations that you can play around with. As a coach, when, when everyone's got those, those caps and whatnot, then let's say you lose Pollard. Uh, let's say in a couple of years, things go badly. That's the future for us. You know, so so let's just pick the whole Western province back line. It's fine. <laughs> so James, uh, like, e, so we, I think we, for once, agree. We all agree. Mm. E, wow, Springbok, uh, Springbok um, rugby, South African rugby, e pilile, e healthy, and uh, good luck to Italy because we're gonna bring it on. Uh, we're looking for a win. We're gonna bring it on Saturday, and that's our show, boys.